I've opened it. For. Yeah. So I think, yeah, to be honest, I'm really, really impressed with what everyone has done. It's, to be honest, when you look at the program back and you say, oh, the program has really, really been successful. And uh, most especially from the project manager, I say DM. Uh, uh, to be honest, it, it was great, actually. Uh, the reason being the fact that, yeah, the one of the time that we had uh, you on the program, which I think is actually br brought the flavor out of of the two ADM and also the project manager being combined together. The Scrum Master has been always been successful anyway. So, yeah, I'm really, really impressed by that. So I will go with those guys that have sent the PowerPoint. Uh, starting with Abimbola. Yeah. So I think you are the first person. Oh, I don't know. So Abimbola was actually the first person that did the presentation, isn't it? Well, okay. No. Okay, starting with Abimbola first. Anyway. Yeah, it was. Yeah. So, yeah, I think that was also great, actually. So hold on, let me go. Yeah, it, it was a great presentation. Anyway, of course, you mentioned different thing. One minute, so I think got to open. Okay, all right. So. Yeah, I think it was it was really, really great anyway. So one thing I want to say, just to be a big critic about it. So when you first started, you started very well, actually, and you did the introduction. Uh, the one thing, I know this applies to everybody. Because I want you to say the right word. Uh, some people are mentioning website, website. Uh, that is a layman way of calling the application that you worked on. When you go for interview and you want to mention the project, I would use web application instead of website. Do you get? But of course, website is still right, but web application is yeah, actually is the terminology is is better. But yeah, I like the introduction and also the objective of your score. So it was actually a great delivery. Yeah, but and also your team, you mentioned that. Well, I think I. I kind of love how you kind of presented, but one thing that I want you to look into is that, hey, okay, is that pronunciation of Azure, right? Is that pronunciation of Azure, bear that in mind. And more often, I would also prefer when we're doing presentation to use our re-artifact because I want to show what you've done. So instead of using screenshots or something like that, uh, what happened, for instance, in the Spring Zero screenshot that you put in there, I saw another person used it as well. I was like, I I've seen this before. <laughs> yeah. So I uh, think... It's, uh, um, DJ, I'm sorry to cut you in. I'm so sorry about this feedback. This the We are the same thing. And this um, the slide that you saw, I am the one that prepared the slide, like the first Spring Zero um, presentation. Okay. All right. So, okay. So someone now used it later, right? So, okay. Uh, that's fine yeah. anyway. So, yeah. So, but okay. Let's let just move on. That's fine. So, okay. So, and um, one thing that you also mentioned is for that in, I think in Sprint 1, there's no increment that was produced, which is fine, which is okay because it happened at work as well. When in a particular sprint, you don't have any increment. I like the fact that you actually mentioned that because it does happen uh, as well. And also going forward, you also mentioned the other sprint that you are able to do some increments into the application, which was fine. So, and um, yeah, and also, yeah, the Actifas was also great as well, which you added. So, and um, so, yeah, now, okay, so because you had one that first started, I put a note in there, but later I found that it applies to mostly everybody, right? Maybe I did not uh, um, give that specific information. Uh, or, of course, there's no time as well, anyway. So, uh, one thing that I would have preferred to see is 
how the board were created, even if it's going to be just artifact on how the boards were created, so that I can be able to be sure that you know how it's done. Because it's a once um, one time setup, it's easy for people to forget how it's done. So, but to be honest, that was a great um delivery and confident as well. So I'm really, really impressed with, with what you've done. Well done with that. So then second. Yeah. The second one is Bearden, okay? Yeah, okay. So, uh, yeah, well done, Bearden. And, yeah, this is another wonderful one as well. So, really, really impressed, actually. You had one. I think there are three or three people that actually mentioned the niche I've done already. And, and at one particular time that you said, which actually, I, I like that, is like, okay, as a scrum master, you serve as a bridge, uh, which I, I kind of, I can, it's it's really, really great, actually, to, to know that you serve as a bridge between the stakeholders and also the development team, actually. So, which I think is, is fine. That's why you say a true leader, actually. So, well done for, for that. So, and the presentation wise it was also great and artifact was also good you so yeah and another comment that i want to say is that uh, okay you mentioned the fact that uh, some issues were addressed except a few ones in sprint four uh yeah to be honest all those uh experience they are very very important because this program is not simulated. That's how it is, even at work, actually. You address some issues, you push another issues to the next one. So you, and also you have issues with the you know, web application at you know, Spring 4, which is still ongoing, you've not resolved it. It does happen like that, even for two sprints, so that everything just crash. But what happened is that you guys need to know, work, work around or how to ensure that you are still able to continue working and you are not folding your hands and that those are the experience i want to see so one thing i would have expected you to say is okay we have this issue but this is what we are able to do to mitigate those issues right because as a scrum master you need to mitigate every risk that you want to you encounter but it was good that you also mentioned that anyway but well done um yeah so one thing that i want to say also yeah you 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 yeah uh, your presentation was very, very great, actually. lot of animation, even though I would have prefer that a bit less, right? Some animation were great, but the one that's got like, um, maybe you want to talk about the next thing, the uh, this animation of that particular thing came on, uh, actually, uh, came on on the on on the screen, which is good. That one is fine because it's just like okay, you don't want to present it before you talk about it, which is fine. But the one that it kind of collapse or you know the lot animation animation, I think you just have to be consistent anyway, so that eventually it's not like flying object or something like that. But having said that, it was it was a very great and bold presentation. So and. Um, one thing I, I will assume that this is a slip of tongue because you were saying I was doing impediment when I, I'm not sure whether that's correct, but I would have preferred that resolved impediment. Do you get it now instead of doing impediment? Sometimes when we are presenting, we say something that we <laughs> we are not we don't it's not what we actually meant anyway, but uh, just to yeah a bit of mm in some places when you are mentioning the velocity anyway so but overall it was a great presentation and i like the impediment part that's the light for me actually which shows that you've been very very busy right it shows that okay this is what i've done this one and it shows that you are also keeping track of what you've been able to do and because those are the things that would form part of your stories when you go for interview to see i resolve this impediment i always saw this impediment so which i think is good i think you are one of those if not the only person that actually put that level of detail in terms of resolving impediment but welcome that was also a great one okay
And next person is Christiana. Christiana. Okay. Wow. Uh, I, 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 love, I love the layout of this particular presentation with Christiana, so which I think is really, really uh, exceptional. So because I, I love how you, it shows that you know how to do a great presentation. So, and Okay, I actually added a comment here. I've forgotten that I will remember later. It's just talking about the project mandate. Oh, uh, okay, let me skip that for now. So, okay, all right. So, uh, one thing in terms of the metrics, right? I, I like I like the fact that you know what happened to your metrics because you are able to explain that oh in the first instance yeah oh we are not burning down properly because we didn't know what we we are doing right but as we kind of know what we are doing we are not burning down fastly which i think is really really good because uh when you first started the program <laughs> you don't you don't know much but later as your knowledge increases then the capacity or the your velocity also increases as well, which I think was really, really good anyway. So having that knowledge is, is great anyway. So one thing that I love in your presentation is how you explain, analyze your metrics, actually, which as a Scrum Master, everyone should know. Everyone should know what happened. Even by looking at the metrics, you should be able to explain what happened, how it happened. So even the velocity metrics, bond down metrics, it's that i think for me that is your strength actually so and also yeah so the retro was also a great one as well so and it, it was a, a great presentation yeah well done for that yeah so and next person is abun olua Okay, so I wonder why you had a great introduction, right? Which is fine, or I think was was great. But one thing is, uh, even myself now, I and I I now question my knowledge, right? Oh, do we call tester quality assurance or do we call them Kiwi? Most people will call them Kiwi. Maybe that's the question I need to post to allow me. Allow me. Do you do you say quality assurance when you are calling testers? Because uh, exactly, I thought I thought so, but you know, we say keywords, right? So we say, Oh, let me speak to the keyway. And when you say that, what do you say? You say quality assurance, it's, it means quality assurance, right? <laughs> so, yeah, it's, it's those things that technology people use them actually because you won't call the testers quality assurance, right? I've never heard it before, but you call them software tester right or kiwi actually so you just need to look at that because in your when you are doing the presentation you mentioned that you have some team members and some of them are business analysts which is fine quality assurance and that yeah i it didn't actually cut it out for me anyway but i'd rather just say tester or kiwi anyway so okay um all right, so moving on from there. So yeah, uh, the onboarding was good. And also, yeah, the wiki was also nice as well. So well done on that aspect. I love the fact that, yeah, you mentioned, yeah, none of, none, say, none of your story was, uh, none of your story actually made the definition of done in a, part, in a particular sprint, which is sprint one, because it does happen as well that, eventually you found that you didn't actually meet definition of done and yeah so which i think is it's something that you should know that it is something that happened at work as well so and though i would uh, prefer that you kind of speak about your chart your abundant chart yeah and yeah so which i'm expecting some more information on that one so but having said that yeah uh, I like one thing I like is the fact that now, uh, even as a scrum master, you roll your sleeve, 
you write you wrote the uh what's it called the requirement or uh requirement for the uh, cyber security guys and i look into what you wrote actually it was kind of close to what a a a ba will have written to be honest so which i think is is good it shows that yeah even if your ba wasn't around you can actually do that role as well which is a good quality of a scrum master so um yeah but i think it was quite yeah it's a slow and steady presentation very nice one at uh, i would say anyway so and yeah i, I kind of love it anyway so we're well done on uh, about that it was it was it was it was another great one as well so yeah so moving on to okay who is this person i think okay ab ab okay ab okay Okay. All right. So yeah, uh, the presentation was nice as well. Anyway, so it um, was also another. Yeah, it was an impressive one, right? So, but one thing I want to say is, I guess some slide that you kind of smuggling in here along the line, which was not in my own slide anyway. But that was is okay. Anyway, I'm just pointing that out. In case you are presenting to the stakeholders, you've sent something before, and yeah, and then you wanted to change, you need to let them know, right? That yeah, your slide has changed, but that that's fine. Just one slide with the Azure DevOps anyway. So, but yeah, uh, having said that, yeah, I, I love what you presented anyway. So I would say the highlight for me was on the sprint um, by sprint. Uh, tax that you did, which shows that you've kind of documented everything. And the reason why I asked everyone to do this, to be honest, like for instance, the sprint by sprint is because it's core, right? When you go for interview, you want to talk about what you've done. And if you're able to align them like that, it shows that you can be able to go for interview and talk about all these things anyway. So which I think is good. And also the repository that you've also added was also great as well. And yes, so yeah, and another thing is I said, yeah, I'm very, very impressed with your work ethic and the level of details in the presentation. It shows that yeah, you took your time, put everything, and yeah, of course you could you could have worked more with time management, but to be honest, uh, I, I I wouldn't I won't beat you up on that one, to be honest, because one way or the other, it just shows that you've got a lot to say, right? And we've got less time. Do you get it now? Which shows that the lot that you've learned on sprint by sprint anyway. So even for other people that have sh that short the time, but I think it just shows that, yeah, you guys have learned a lot with, with that. So and sometimes if you did not le learn anything, right, there's nothing to say anyway. So which I think is, is really, really good. I was talking to one of my mentees in the advance that got the job and he was saying that, oh, I went for this interview and it was just a chat. But it's a chat because you know how to keep up that discussion, right? That is the same thing. Uh, if you know how to kind of say this thing and you, do, you, are, you are confident about it, when you go for interview, it'll be like you are only chatting because you know what you need to say. So I want to say well done for, for that, yeah. Okay, so next person is Modupe, I think. Yeah, Modupe. Okay, so okay, so I think this is this is wonderful one as well. So this is this is good, right? So even though I will have prefer yeah, uh, screenshot that you do yourself, no screenshot of a, a, our own training, but but that's fine anyway. So yeah, but it was it was it was great anyway. But look out for some typo on the yeah 
on the presentation and we're but it's it's really really great so uh, i love i love the presentation um and also you put the what's it called the screenshot of the tools that you we use but yeah and also that all uh so that's why i said i could have preferred you to kind of do your own rather than doing the screenshots from from a tutor slide anyway but of course it's it's it's, it's good anyway so okay and Okay, so one of the things that you also mentioned that I just want to point out is okay, the issue at the start of the sprint. I, I'm not sure that you actually wanted to say at the start of the sprint or at the start of the program because that was the beginning anyway. So, but of course, you said the which is the issue with uh, unavailability of team members. Later, you said that was kind of improved anyway. So maybe you wanted to say at the start of the program instead of at the start of the sprint, but that but as you go along, I think it was it was a great presentation anyway. So I love how you analyze you had, I think yeah so you analyze this slide which I think was really really great actually talking about it uh, yeah so it shows that you know how so sorry I said slides the metrics anyway so yeah so it shows that you know how to interpret the metrics actually so it was a confident uh, presentation actually uh, so I'm I'm really really impressed about that so you delivered it confidently and it was it was really really great well done so and um, next person is Olua Muke Shegun so when you first started I was like okay this presentation is a little boring <laughs> right so because you were just uh, okay, uh, I, I thought it was something that was just put together in the rush. But eventually, I think you actually proved me wrong anyway. But there's some sketchy part that you could you could improve anyway. Of course, I know you know that anyway. So in terms of yeah, the first four, let's say, is it seven slides that you could you could maybe put some images or pictures or so, and also like um Azure DevOps, DevOps with Capital O, I've already been mentioning this anyway. So, but except from that, the level of detail is great anyway. So it shows that you know what you've done, you can atom atomize what you've done per sprint, and also you have the record of every activity and the tasks that you've done. And the same thing applies to the impediments that you resolved as well. But as the presentation went on then yeah it, be, it became better so which i think was really really great so and you put the you know images of your artifacts which i think yeah so and talking about what you the artifacts that were done sprint by sprint yeah so So you yeah, I like the fact that you explain all the tasks that you've done in the sprint. Which yeah, so I it's it's a very well done presentation. At the end, even though in the beginning it was like okay, you are just reading this slide, but at the end it was actually I would say well done. Yeah, yeah. So okay. All right, so the next person, Ogunti May, Ogunti May, okay. So, okay, so I think this is another wonderful one, actually. Yeah, so one thing I kind of like, while well, it's you know, the project plan, I saw it on the on that slide as well, which for I I'm not sure that you are the first one or the second person anyway, but I, I love that it was like, okay, this is how we plan our um, project and this is what we did, this is who is responsible, which I think is really, really great to see that perspective. Uh, I like your uh, tax, uh, sprint by sprint tax as well and the details of that shows that you know what you've done 
And to be honest, this is one of those ones that say, okay, uh, I don't even know how to fault it anyway. So because it was it was great actually, even and also the presentation as well. Anyway, the slide it was good, and you, and even the layout, everything, everything just kind of fit in. To be honest, so and so and on, not only that, so. Oh, uh, Olumide, you are in Nigeria, right? If you are, if you're still there, so because initially I was having uh impression about how I was thinking anyway that we are not going to extend the scholarship to the Nigerian guys because of uh, the fact that some people in the program are not were not just kind of pulling their weight. So I had that impression, but having to, when I saw your presentation, it was like, okay, maybe I might have another second thought about this, but it was really, really great anyway. So we're well done for that. So, yeah. So next person is Adedeji. Okay. So, wow. If I want to say this is the best presentation even I would say in the whole internship, actually, right. <laughs> so it's beautiful. It is beautiful, beautiful slide. And it shows that you know how to own the slide. You know how to present, to be honest. To be, I don't I don't need to give you a, a feedback, to be honest. You just yeah, you are just a presenter. You you own the slide, you own your words, you own the delivery, to be honest. So and <laughs> If I have to give 100%, I'll give 1,000% for this particular one. So, and of course, uh, the way you kind of also laid out the um, project actually was great. Actually, I can see, oh, we have three projects. This is what we've done, this is what we've done. And on, on those three projects, and you went into, yeah, sprint by sprint on what is done. To be honest, I, I was like, wow, this is this is good. So, and if and also not only that the level of detail that you put in there right is great so it's talking about the pid and you put all the screenshots of those pids in there so which i think is to be honest for me i was like wow where were you before actually so I, I really want to see you in advance to be honest so because yeah i've got a tax for you anyway so let's yeah to be this is great. Maybe I should actually do this review at the end anyway, but that was that was exceptional. Well done. So uh, that was Adedeji anyway. Yeah. Oh, we even bear the same name anyway. So maybe that's the reason. Yeah. So okay. All right. Next person uh is Ian. Okay. Um, uh, yeah, so even I think for Ian, I don't know. I was expecting a lot from you, right? Because maybe because I've, yeah, not that I know you, but you know, when you kind of people talking and you expect that, yeah, this person, uh, because you've done some presentation before, and I was saying, I was expecting that you would do a lot, right? Maybe because I saw IADG's one and I thought, oh, okay, yeah. But one thing I say, the, data at the beginning was great actually so which other people did not put those level of detail in there right which i think was was good anyway to put that level but the only thing i want to say is like all those screenshots at the end i, I was not looking for those ones even though for instance the responsibility of a scrum of a project manager unless you are telling me you the you are the one that did it which is good anyway but I, I don't want people just copy and paste from somewhere and just put it. But if you did it, that was brilliant anyway. So that was that was good. And so stakeholder management process, yeah, was was fine. So yeah, uh, okay. I think I've mentioned that I prefer real active arts. Yeah. Okay. So um. Okay. Yeah, I think one thing that I just put a comment here, allow me, this is, yeah, put this down, yeah. So I'm thinking for the next batch, we'll just put the PM with the cybersecurity. I'll speak to Pat 
because yeah, we just yeah, the PM will just work and directly with the server security. I think that will really, really work well. So I also will give even the server security guys to know how waterfall works anyway. So okay. But except from that, I think it was also a great presentation. I think the highlight is the budget, to be honest. So which I think is yeah, was was good. So and um, it just shows that, yeah, but <laughs> Uh, one one question is like we are over the budget, so where do they get the money from? That's a question that you might need to answer from the stakeholder because your actual is over over is lower than the budget. Yeah, hold on. Oh, no, no, not really. Actually, right, because even the budget is less. So, and you are saying you are over. Okay, all right, use minus anyway. But I think you need to look, but the, yeah, the presentation was good anyway. The budget is good, but uh, look into how to present the over one actually, because yeah, in, when I first look at it, I saw, are we over the budget? Because it's minus. And we will look at minus, that means you're in depth anyway. So, but looking at it again, it shows that it's actually not in deficit, which I think we are. We are not over the budget in terms of how much we spent. So the pre, uh, the project, yeah, MS project was also great as well. So it was it was also a great presentation anyway. So well done, Ian, for that. So yeah, um, I'm I'm impressed as well. So with what you've done anyway, yeah. So well done. So then the key at the key at okay, and yeah, it was was also a great one anyway. So. One, yeah, the layout of, of the pro three projects that you worked on was good. And the fact that you are able to kind of uh, identify the methodology that each one of them was that, which is good anyway. So you, yeah, talking about the you know, web application, yeah. So, but you, are, you did not create web application for Blue Sky Citadel, okay. So, because even the web application was a rich icon web application, it's just that we brought it into, into Blue Sky anyway. So, yeah. And, yeah, and the Oracle. So, we I think for the next batch, this maybe this is a question for Laomi as well. We would we we'll bring SharePoint in as a project for the ADM and also the project manager because we already kind of started that as well because i found that the oracle acm really really work well anyway and also so yeah we might have more than three projects for the next batch anyway so which i think will really be good so yeah aside from that uh, i love the your spring by spring activities which is good uh was brilliant so uh, to be honest, when I look at you guys, it just shows that the project management class has have done very, very well. Actually, I'm impressed with I need to give uh uh your the feedback, yeah, because this because from what you guys have delivered and also even from the Oracle class as well. So it was it was a great way to bring all the three projects together, most of all, especially putting you in the Oracle as well, and also in the mentor skit. I think that turned out to be a great, you know, decision. So, and yeah, so well done, uh, Zekiat, for, for the presentation. Uh, uh, I, uh, I think for, I like the risk register, uh, which I think also is, is, a, is a great addition to your slide as well. Other people don't have that anyway. So it was, was also great anyway. So, okay. All right, quickly, let's move to those guys with the Word document, ebook con. Okay, all right, ebook con. I really don't know what happened. If you're there, I need you to unmute. Actually, this is very, very important, okay? So, but you, are you there? Yeah, it's a great effort, but I yeah. need to know what, yeah, I need to know what happened. All right. I need to know what happened. Mm? Yeah. Um. Sorry, I don't get a question, please. Yeah, because what you presented was below par. Right. So, and 
you just copied and pasted your Word document into a PowerPoint, right? And even those Word document that you supplied was only one page, right? And yeah, it didn't actually kind of uh, get up. It's not up to the standards that I was looking for, right? But having said that, right, because one thing, I believe you are a very great presenter, right? You deliver those things very well, but your effort is not commensurable to what you said. You get my points now? Yes, I get your point. I am expecting a lot, but, and I know you know a lot because the way you presented that, it shows that you have a lot in your head, right, that you can pour out, but you do not put them on paper or you do not type them out. That's why I said what really happened. Um, yeah, I had like an issue with my machine. Like I'm not very adept with like um presentations and slides like that. So but but even with the word, right? It was half a page that you sent. Yeah, it will come. So yeah, you need to redo really this, okay? And you send it to support at blue sky, right? And it's important that you do so, okay. Sure. All right. Thank you. Okay. okay. All right. But to be honest, you know, I, I believe that's why I believe that you know what to do, right? You just need to sit down and do that because your presentation was great, right? And you said a lot of things, but you need to put them in writing, right? And I believe that you can do so. That's why I'm asking you to redo them, right? So I'm I'm giving you that motivation to be able to put them out. Yeah, if that's okay. 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 We'll All right. So I'll move on that note. I think there's another person I want to speak to as well. On um, yeah, Allo as well. Okay. Allo Oluashem Oluashem. Are you there? Allo Oluashem. Similar thing as well. Right. Okay. It's not. Yeah. So it was also below average actually so uh, unfortunately i won't mix the word yeah uh, i was expecting more from you you just kind of go through yeah it's something that you put out in maybe one hour or thereabouts and you put the bullet points what you've done so yeah so i really need you to speak right to know what actually went wrong right because this is this is really not anyway so if you once, yeah, I wouldn't, I wouldn't accept this to be unfortunately, right? So you might also need to redo it. If you are going to get certificate or get anything from us, you have to redo this one, okay? So, but of course, yeah, great effort anyway, well done for that, but it's, it's not what I'm expecting, unfortunately, if I may say, yeah, okay? All right, so if I move on. Okay, I move on to Oluwa, Oluwa Jare, Oluwambe. Okay, so yeah, <laughs> I don't want to go back to what transpired within that anyway, but yeah, I think, yeah, even though some of this slide that you presented were screenshot from our, pre our presentation but that is fine anyway so it's okay so and also i want you to watch some of the way you describe things as well because you in some part you say oh in sprint zero we see many things on the screen on the scrum board i don't know what, what you are seeing so there's nothing on the scrum board you actually created it from sprint zero anyway so, but maybe that was just a uh, slip of tongue. Uh, I love your interview questions that you added, which I think is good. Anyway, well done on that one. And also the tasks that you completed were also great as well. So it was a great presentation as well, well done. And yeah, so on, on that aspect. So who is next? Okay, so I will go to...
I'll go to Angela, Angela, a brother anyway. I'm not sure if I said I wanted a video or a presentation, but you did a video, which I is, is okay anyway. So, so yeah. Uh, I, I, if it, if it has been a presentation, it will have been better because you won't have to be skipping forward and back and everything. Yeah. So, but looking at what you presented was wonderful, was great as well. So, and you went through your sprint zero activities and talking about the organogram of of your team, team charter was also brilliant anyway. So I, I know a lot of people mentioned team charter, but you kind of now expanded that also putting screenshots of each of the parts of the screen, team charter. So I, I love, yeah, I, it, the theme that you selected where uh, I think was cool actually, um, yeah. And also the presentation was also great as well. And even the delivery, how you kind of delivered it as well. So um, your activity is spring by sprint, and even the topic that was covered, I think, yeah, I'm, I think you are the only person that actually presented that from the um, project management or APM side, actually talking about this, what we did uh, spring uh, week by week and the topics anyway. The reason being the fact that it's easy for people to forget, right? But if you don't forget what you learned, then you go for an interview and talk about what you've done and what you've learned, which I think is good. So well done on that aspect. So it was another great presentation. Well done. So um, next person. Okay, next person is Robert, okay? Okay, so uh, this is great anyway, so, but uh, yeah, of course, with the fact that you joined late anyway, but that that's fine, so, but it, it was a great one. Uh, if it's not, I will, I will have told you anyway. So, but one thing you also need to kind of watch out the pronunciation of Azure and Actifat, okay? So, and because you kind of mix them up anyway, so during the presentation, but uh, to be honest, I love, I love uh, the, yeah, sprint too. But to be honest, at the point I get confused, I was like, are you a cyber security person or a scrum master? <laughs> because you dwell more on the wanna cry uh ransom attack and everything yeah uh in in some level of of your presentation but uh, it's yeah it is okay maybe it's a, it's an area that you are passionate about anyway so but having said that so moving on to the responsibility that was great and also the tools that was used as well and the boss word, yeah, but boss word, boss, yeah, is not B O S S, but B U Z Z anyway. So, but just, yeah, watch over, uh, just look at that anyway. So, but to be honest, I'll, uh, those definitions are great as well. So, and as you were the only person that can, I saw that on the, on the report anyway. So, yeah, it was great. So I could, the only thing that I was expecting some screenshot of the activity that you've done. So it would be good if you if you had added them anyway. But it's having said that, it's, it's also a great presentation as well. Okay. And next person... Okay, all right. Next person, Nina. Okay. And 
Okay, so when you first start, Nena, this is Nena. Okay, when you first started, I think it was like, okay, uh, I was like, I was questioning myself, are we going to be talking about agile methodology or something? But I think later, I, yeah, so it, it get better as you go along because I think you do more on that first page more, all right? But as you go along, I like, but even though, even though I love the fact that you mentioned that you may not be giving project mandates, right? Um, by the stakeholder, sometimes you might have to draw up the the mandate by yourself, yeah. which I think was really really great. You just could say that okay, the G, maybe next, um, what was it next uh, internship? Maybe we should not even give them the mandate. Let them go <laughs> go and draw it up. So, which I think even at work it does happen. So. Uh, of course, the stakeholder will just give you a sketch about I'm trying to develop blah blah blah. You have to come up with a with a mandate about it. Then, of course, the stakeholder would kind of um, validate that. But in some other cases, the project mandate might be given to you as well. So, um, yeah. Okay. So yeah, but to be yeah, so that is fine. Yeah, I love the um, project charter and which I think is good, and also the racing matrix as well. So and the organogram was good. And one thing that I I, I kind of kind of put some star, 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 right? So, okay, this is good. Anyways, like, okay, breakdown of payment per day, because that would take a lot of effort for you to have done that. So uh, how much everyone or what should be paid per day, who should be paid, who not to be paid, which I think was, it just shows that you've committed time and resources to the program anyway. So and well done on that aspect. And other artifact, and other thing that you put 20, responsibilities and the tools as well and the buzzwords yeah so yeah so i think it was also great as well so to be honest this is this is a wonderful one so i'm really really impressed about this one so well done nina on on that aspect that's that's good so and um, moving on to olusheji yeah So yeah, Olusha, this is this is this is a very very great one. One well, not only that because one, even the delivery was great, it was awesome, and you also manage your time properly, right? You finish ahead of time, and I not only that because one, if the presentation you got lots of things on 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 it anyway, but I, I like that. Okay, you. You just go straight to the point. Talk about what you, what you've done. Spring by spring, it was great. And even when you started, to be honest, I just put it up. Even the the start was bold, bold start. I I I just put a comment. I like it already. Actually, even on the first slide, how you kind of introduced and started it anyway. So it was really really great. So and as we went through it as well. So and. No, another thing that you also did that actually caught it for me, uh, which other people did not do, is like you use the read mode, right? Which even though is in on the word, it makes it good actually. So which I think was really really great. Well done. And um, yeah, so yeah, Olusha, that that was a great one to be honest. So we, uh, uh, I really love it anyway. So that is. Exception and that's good. So, and um, yeah, man, I said I can. It is is a job well delivered and done anyway. So and I can't I can't even fault it. Um, yeah. So well done for that. So okay, and I think the last person should be King David, right? Okay. 
maybe I left it to the last because it was was the best as I think out of the word documents. Uh, I'm not sure uh, which one is the best one. Is the Adedeji or King David Totubene? This is awesome. This is awesome. Uh, this is just like a kind of presenting a paper or a it was it was great starts. Yeah, it was is what you see in I really don't, uh, to be honest, this is out of the world anyway. So I'm um, really, really impressed. I cannot continue uh, actually singing your praise on this. Not only that you went through the program, you also put your own experience, what you, yeah, uh, what you've learned, what you, the highlight of the you know, program for you, right? So, which I think was, was also great as well. So then you then went from spring zero activities on and on like that so it was yeah and so to be honest it was i don't even if i want to be critical about it, i i couldn't see anything actually to be honest so and and not only that even in terms of details of what you've done and also the presentation as well so that uh, is is good and one thing also is even the uh what's it called the title the titles of the of this print actually talking about and you are able to put it in the in how it should be for instance print two authentication authorization functionality so all those things like that anyway so um so the goals of each of these prints and which i think is is good and for that what you use as you go as you go along using estimation creating epics and so to be honest i think it was was also a great one as well so well done for for that so, okay i think that is me allow me so over to you thank you so much everyone to be honest is is really really great actually so only i think two people uh i was not so kind of on keen on what they've done and I've given them feedback but everyone every other people person has done very well exceptionally well so I'm really really impressed with what you guys have done and yeah it's it's you just kind of make us proud to be honest so well done so I want to see you guys start to apply for the job and bring it on okay and of course, I want to see you guys also in advance as well so that we can be able to follow up on those momentum that we've we've started anyway. So okay, if and if you have not applied for the advance, please do apply. It's tomorrow. <laughs> tomorrow is deadline anyway. Okay. All right, cool. Thank you.